Our 27th question, which of the following should come in the empty box in the flow chart given? All right? 27th one, which? Of the following, which of the following should come in, should come in the empty box? empty box in the flow chart below in the flow chart all right first one fruit new plant new plant so your options are they are asking us what should come in the empty box A Option A, seed. Option B, bird. Option C, fruit. And option D, stem. Now here we have to choose from what comes in the empty box. What is this one? Option A, seed. The answer here is seed. What comes in the box? The answer is seed. Seed comes in the empty box. Okay? Now, 28th question. Our 28th question. In desert plants, in desert plants, Leaves modify, leaves modify, leaves modify into thorns, into thorns, leaves modify into thorns. How do thorns, how do thorns, thorns help a plant, help a plant, that's the question, alright, A, let's go into option A, 
They catch food. They catch this tow water this tow water option C they protect the plant they protect the plant they protect the plant from being from being eaten from being eaten by animal by animal there are three options to choose from and desert in desert plant leaves modify into thorn now they are asking us how do leaves help a plant the answer is option c they help they protect the plant from being eaten by the animals that's the correct answer our 29th question our 29th question is which of the following should come in the empty box given below our 29th question which of the following should come should come in the empty box given below okay water from roots water from roots water in the leaves in the leaves and your options are a flowers option a flowers option b stem option c fruit and option d bark a question is which of the following should come in the empty box given below water from roots okay from the root where does it go the answer it goes into the stem water from roots water to the stem then from the stem water goes into the leaf that's the correct answer our thirtieth question the leaves of which of the following plants can be eaten okay the leaves the leaves of of which of the which of the the leaves of which of the following 
plant can be eaten and option A basil option B mint option C beetle and option D all of these We have four options. Now, which the leaves of which of the following can be eaten? Basil leaves, we can eat. Mint leaves, we can eat. Betel leaves, we can eat. So, all of these, all A, B, C, all the options are correct. Our very first question, dash a climbing plant. That are weak stems need support. Okay. Dash. Are climbing plants. Climbing plants. That have. That have weak stems. And need support. And need support. A. Herbs. B. Trees. C. Climbers. And option D. Shrubs. Let's look at which is the correct answer. Dash are climbing plants that are weak stems and need support. Is it herb, tree, shrub? No. Climbers are climbing plants. Climbers are climbing plants that have weak stems and need support. Let's look at all the questions and answers. Which of the following should come in the empty box in the flow chart? Flower, fruit, dash, new plant, seed. Okay? Flower, fruit, seed. In desert plant, leaves modify into thorns. How do the thorns help a plant? Thorns help protect the plant from being eaten by animals. Which of the following should come in box? Come in the empty box given below. Water from roots goes into stem, from stem water into the leaves. So option B, stem is correct. The leaves of which of the following plants can be eaten? Basil can be eaten, mint can be eaten, beetle can be eaten, so all of these. Climbers are climbing plants that have weak stems and need support. So, option C, climbers is the correct answer.